Hi, my name is Eric Peterson, and I am co-advised by Sherry Cook and Scott Summers, both in environmental engineering here at CU. And my research is funded by the College of Engineering here at CU. My research is investigating ozone and biofiltration as a treatment technique in water reuse. So the background here is that water suppliers are challenged to provide enough drinking water uh, because of issues like population growth and climate change. And so reusing uh, treated wastewater as an additional water source um, is becoming uh, more popular. And ozone biofiltration is one, one treatment mechanism that's being looked at. And so for this experiment, we are looking at how ozone biofiltration can remove organic matter from uh, the wastewater effluent. So what we do is we take wastewater effluent from full-scale wastewater plants, and we first apply ozone gas. And the ozone gas is gonna be able to oxidize some of that organic matter, and it will also make the organic matter more biodegradable. So then we feed that water to the biofilter. So the biofilter is set up here at the bench scale with anthracite media that has biofilms attached to it. As the water passes through the biofilter, those biofilms are able to consume some of the organic matter, and we end up with, uh, with cleaner water at the end. And we set it up in uh, three columns here so that we can sample from the bottom of each column, and that's gonna allow us uh, to investigate how organic matter is removed at different depths within a biofilter. So ultimately the goal here is to help us understand how the ozone biofiltration uh, works at the full scale so we can design full scale plants that will help provide enough clean drinking water for us to use in the future.